Do you think global warming isn't real? Well, you're not alone. Many people think that, and it's because there are lots of myths out there. These myths usually exist because of misinformation spread by some greedy corporations who benefit from us not acting, and people who actually fear climate change. Before we check out the last 5 myths, if you missed it, click on the link below for part 1 of the top 10 biggest global warming myths. Let's bust some more myths in part 2. Myth 6. Science can't predict the future accurately. Since scientists can't experiment on the entire Earth, they use computers to predict what might happen with the climate. These computer models are like advanced climate forecasts that use mathematical formulas to model the atmosphere and the oceans. Sounds exciting, doesn't it? While they can't be perfectly accurate, they give us a pretty clear range of what the future might look like. And this means we know that we need to take action now to avoid harmful scenarios. Myth 7. Don't worry, science will fix it. We keep hearing about new technologies like clean coal, hydrogen energy and carbon capture as our tickets to a greener future. Some people even suggest wild ideas like sprinkling iron in the ocean or launching mirrors into space. Yeah mirrors into space, but research shows that these might actually make things worse and we wouldn't want a real-life version of Snowpiercer. These technologies, while promising on paper, also often come with big risks. For example, clean coal and carbon capture still use fossil fuels, keeping us dependent on them. While these technologies might help in the future, we can't just wait for them, and there are things that we already know we can do to fight climate change. Myth 8. Melting the ice caps is good for the economy. Sure, melting arctic ice could open new shipping routes and give access to oil and gas, but burning these fuels is what caused the ice to melt in the first place. Thinner ice makes global warming worse because it reflects less sunlight and it also changes ocean currents which could lead to sudden climate changes. This could even make countries in the north much colder. Myth 9. We can adapt. It's true that we usually find ways to deal with problems, but climate change is tougher because we only have one Earth. Not everyone will be able to handle it easily, so how well we cope depends on how much money we have and where we live. Some might face big problems like floods, droughts, or not enough food, and in some cases, it could get so bad that people can't adapt at all. That's why it's so important to cut greenhouse gases now, so that things don't get even worse. Lastly, Myth 10. Why worry? It's too late to do anything. We can still do something about climate change. The latest report from the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change says that if we reduce greenhouse gases significantly starting now, we can prevent the worst effects. So using clean energy, cutting emissions and changing how we live can help. The IEA, which is the International Energy Agency, says that using renewable energy like wind or solar can greatly lower carbon emissions. This means that small actions by all of us, such as turning off lights, recycling and using less water, can also make a big difference. With that in mind, every effort helps slow down climate change, protects the earth and makes life better for everyone. Have you got more global warming myths? If you do, share them in the comments below and we'll get on them for you. Learn more about the climate because there are things we can do about it.